Meet Louis. He lives in Edinburgh Zoo and likes to eat apples. His new Dutch friend Paul is also fond of them. This is the sound he used to make when asking for an apple. But after a few years with his Scottish chimp family, Paul has learned to ask for it their way. To human ears, the grunts may sound quite similar, but researchers say finding out chimps can learn each other's sounds is a breakthrough. It's not clear at the moment, and we need a bit more research to find out whether or not, uh, before they started matching calls, could they still understand one another? Is this like uh, me learning the French word for apple so that I can communicate with a French person? Or is it like me moving to Glasgow and after five years I start speaking with a Glaswegian accent? The idea that the Dutch chimps speak with a Scottish accent certainly entertained visitors. That's absolutely bizarre. It's hilarious. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> wow. <laughs> so just prove they are like humans because we do the same thing, don't we? Yeah. This research suggests that our ancestors' behaviour is far more similar to our own than originally thought. And it helps explain what's so special about human communication. The ability to talk to one another has developed as the two groups bonded. And it seems the new arrivals have even developed a taste for porridge. Laura Bicker, BBC News, Edinburgh.